Hey, welcome back to another tutorial. This time we're going to go over how to find people in sessions, as this uh, periodically comes up for new users and I'll just get over it. Let me hop over into Smooth POV and I'll show you around these objects. So there are three of uh, these objects that are common uh, to be seen. Uh, there is the one on the left here, which is common in sort of newer worlds. Uh, it was made by the community. You can make your own one of these. Uh, there's this one in the middle here, which is common in the Neos hub and other official worlds, such as the NPC, things like that. And then there's one on the right here, which is common in uh, older worlds. It's just sort of a colored plate with not many other uh, decorations on it. You'll see that this says top 30 active sessions on it for all of them, except the community one over here. And what this means is it's showing you the active sessions. If you look for a pink outlined uh, world. So here is a pink one. Um, you'll see that it has one person in it, that's the number to the right here, and that uh, Neosmotic is hosting it. Over here we have RealPy's world with one user in it and RealPy is hosting it. Over there is Galaxy's crib with two people inside it hosted by Galaxy. If you see blue or pink, they're not blue or pink, they're purple. If you see purple orbs um, here, so uh, only a cylinder persistent or uh, prop hunt game persistent. Those are headless worlds which are being hosted by servers to facilitate easy joining of sessions um, without there needing to be a host. You're more than welcome to use these, but there are no one, there's no one in them. If they change from purple to pink, then it means people are inside them and you can check by the number to the right of the ball. So again here, sci-fi home hosted by orange, three people inside it. If you can't see anyone on these plates, um, then it may be that you are uh, logging in here at a weird time of day. So uh, Neos is still a relatively small community. We are getting up to sort of active users of 100 or so, um, but there are dead periods and quiet periods. In that case, I'd recommend you join a headless or create a world. There might be someone else online that's going to come and uh, hang out with you. Or you might actually be in a troubleshooting stage where you need to, a state, sorry, where you need to uh, do some troubleshooting. In this case, I would recommend you post in questions and help on uh, the Neos Discord. Um, things that can cause these plates to be empty are uh, being on a different version. So for example, Neos has just released a new version um, as of recording this video. So some people are on the old version, some people are on the new version. Um, when you're posting questions and help, please provide that version. You can find that on your hub. So if I turn on my private UI here and I open up my dash, you can see here at the top middle that it says beta 2020.7.24.446. That's the number that someone in questions and help will need to help you. Next to that is the server status. If this says anything other than good, please let us know as well. And to the left of that is the number of online users. If this is ridiculously low, then it also might be a quiet period where not many people are online. Additionally, if you um, have a um, system clock, so your computer clock, if that is not synchronized, um, to uh, the internet time or out of date, then you may see no people here as well. So make sure that your computer clock is synchronized with the internet and that it's up to date. Also make sure that you have an internet connection and that you have no files which may be blocking um, outgoing or incoming connections to Neos. I will see you next time. That's about it for sort of sessions and session plates. I hope this helps. I just wanted to do a quick video on it that uh, was purely focused for new users. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.